The first wave of American athletes have arrived in Birmingham to prepare ahead of the Olympic Games. More than 100 competitors will be using the city as their base. Well, the bad weather forced them to train indoors today, but the athletes were still a big hit with local school children. Nick Clitheroe reports. Arriving at the Alexander Stadium in Birmingham this morning, the advance party of the most successful athletics team in Olympic history. Only around 25 of the USA squad have travelled to England so far, more are due to arrive early next week. But they're already making a good impression. 400 metres hurdle champion Michael Tingsley went for a walkabout during a school sports event next to the stadium. Birmingham has been great so far, man. They have a study yard um, training facility in there, so when it's a little damp outside, you can always go in and train. So it's been nice so far. It's been very good and I've enjoyed it so far. Very exciting and happy to be here today. They've been experiencing a heat wave in America recently, so maybe the rain's a blessed relief. Unfortunately, it did drive most of the athletes indoors to train. Except for Michael Tinsley, of course, who's rapidly gaining his own Birmingham fan club. Michael, Michael, Michael. Pole vaulter Brad Walker, who won the world title in 2007, was another to brave the rain and put smiles on faces. I hope that after you guys meet me, you'll also cheer for the US and cheer for myself while we're competing. I'd just like to thank you guys for all coming out and support. And Michael was there again to get a picture for his scrapbook. Next to experience the charm of the American team with the media. Their primary focus is to win medals, but they're winning plenty of friends too. People will ask, are you here for the Olympics? And I say yes, and then they sometimes ask a little further, well, are you competing? And then the instant you say, yes, I'm competing, the, the face just lights up and it's like, oh my gosh, that's so amazing. And they get very excited and um, very inviting and just really kind of it's, it's fun to share that excitement with them in those moments. The team will spend the next week here before moving down to the Olympic Village. Nick Clitheroe, BBC Midlands Today, Birmingham. Well, this time